Yeah, I just want you guys to understand something real fast. Like, I make all my YouTube videos, and I write my book and stuff because it's, it's 2021, bro. Like, like I'm time traveling in my head, time traveling outside my body, meeting my future self face to face. Like, we literally have rocket ships that can land themselves. Okay, just think about that. We have rockets that can land themselves. But yet here we are still killing each other over racism. We still have people commenting on videos calling people schizophrenic. Oh, you're on drugs. You're ugly. Ah, ah, ah. Like, where is that coming from? That's coming from within ourselves, bro. We can all heal all of the struggle and pain and hatred within ourselves. And nobody is telling each other how to do that. Do you realize that? Like, I don't mean to sound like full of myself or anything, but like, we need to step it up, bro. It's 2021. 2021. <laughs> I'm going to tell you guys how my future self was speaking to me the other night. I was having a conversation with myself, literally talking to myself. Like, I want you to understand that. My future self was telling me that all the people who were commenting on my video that blew up, all calling me crazy, schizophrenic, it's not real, prove it, uh, win the lottery, you know, putting all that pressure on me, trying to make me feel bad, all that hatred inside of them, that was just fear inside of their heads. They were so scared of the truth that the only thing that they could blame was schizophrenia or drugs. And my future self was telling me that not all of them, but some of them were literally about to change their minds. And I kind of gave up on them. I kind of said like, oh, bro, I'm just here to help you, you know. No, like some people need to be encouraged, like motivated beyond just being extremely kind. And I, I, I was extremely kind in my most recent TikTok when I was telling people to step it up. Like I didn't mean like... Oh, I'm above all of you. I'm better than you. I'm saying step it up because you have all of this within you. You are all capable of doing this. And I love every single person. I love the haters. I love my supporters. I want everybody to know this shit because it's 2021 and we're still out here raiding capitals and fucking killing each other, worrying about politics. Like, oh, I'm Republican. I'm Democrat. Like, get out of here, man. Like, I'm on what the CIA or CIA says, focus level 34 slash 35, where beings meet. Okay, I'm going to be telling you guys a story soon about when I literally met an alien, okay? I met an alien, and I met a group of people who we all know each other, and we meet somewhere in the universe, okay? Our bodies are not the end. Earth is not the end. There is so much more to life and reality and the universe than you can even fucking imagine, okay? All of those people who were hating on me and calling me crazy, they're all just hurting inside deeply. My future self told me to group them all together on that video, tag them all in the post so that they could see how serious I was. And you know what happened? A bunch of them changed their minds big time. People were telling me I was a good man. Some of them were thanking me. This one guy started watching the KRS one videos. He was like, man, this guy's saying so many facts, bro. Thank you and stuff. Like, my future self was telling me that the night before I made that TikTok, and it said just to make it in the morning. That Like, the, the night time was not the time to make it. It said make it in the morning first thing. And when I woke up, like, first thing I had that on my mind is, like, I got to make that video, and I got to tell some people to step it up, get on my level, and... I kind of said that just to get them, like, attention, you know, like, argh, like, telling me to step it up, make them listen, motivate them, because I'm telling you right now, I had a football coach that pumped me up so much, that you, phew, all right, I'm going to tell you what my football coach did this one time, it was a kickoff, a kickoff for football, you know, like, when you kick the ball and everybody's running at each other, trying to hit each other and, you know, get the ball and start off the play, you know, my football coach, before that kickoff, he, he literally looked at me. He was like this. and I'm, <laughs> I'm going to look funny doing this, but he was he was seriously like, he was like, 
I want you to go out there and I want you to hit someone. <laughs> He's like, I want you to hit someone. And I remember when he said that, I was like, yeah, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to hit all those people. And I'm going to, I'm going to impress you and I'm going to show you what I'm made of. You know, like I'm going to, I'm going to step it up because I have that within me. You know what I'm saying? Right after that, I go out on that field, hit one person, knock him on his ass. Another person's coming, hit him, knock him on his ass. Third person's coming, hit him, knock the wind out of him, knock him on his ass. And then after that, I'm turning around trying to run back and hit more people. My coach literally made me feel so happy. He said the most inspiring shit to me. He, he said that he would remember that for the rest of his life, and he was so impressed and amazed by it. He literally put all of that energy inside me, motivated me, made me step it up, realize that I had all that potential inside of me, and I want the whole world to know that. You can think I was egotistical or whatever in that video, but that was me being really serious, man. Like, I have a big, big plan, okay? I've been seeing a lot of things. I know a lot of things that you don't know yet a lot of things and sometimes people just have to look you in the eye and see how serious you are and there was no anger within me in that video I'm, I'm telling you right now that I have made myself happy like there's no more sadness missing anybody anger jealousy I let that all go instantly anytime someone tries pumping something negative inside of me i can just let it go and i won't send it into the past i won't dwell on it i won't even think about it in the present i don't let it enter my body or my mind my soul my heart it, it, it's just not there man like i'm telling you you clear your mind of all that negativity and the only thing that comes to you is just the perfect thoughts bro the future when you're not thinking about the past the future is coming to you Everything I'm saying, I've proved. It's not It's not beliefs. You can say it's spirituality, but it's science. I've seen so many things in my whole life. Like Time travel is real. We're all time travelers. We're time travelers in our head. And you can be like legit time travelers who go outside their body, force their past selves out of their own body too, and speak to each other. You can literally change the past, man. That's what my future self did. It changed the past. It came to see me and said to stop thinking about this girl that was ruining my life. And that made me realize how I can literally take all the sadness outside of my body and not send it into the past. Like, my future self saved me. And I want you to know that you can all save yourselves too. And the whole world can save itself. We're, we're all capable of doing this, and I love every single one of you, and I promise that I mean that with all of my heart, and I don't want you to think that I was hating on you or trying to make you feel bad because you have all of this inside of you, and I want you to step it up. If you're hating on people, if you're racist, angry, sad, step it up because you don't have to feel that way. I love listening to all your stories. I love talking to every single one of you. Like it really means the world to me and I love the feeling to know that like I'm not alone. Like I've met people who are writing books about the same stuff I'm talking about. The time travel. Someone literally told me, "Hey, I wrote a whole book about that." This one guy said, oh, "I I talk to my future self all the time. I have a meditation that I can send you." He sent me a free meditation that he charges people money for. Just because he, he respected me and what I was doing. Man, like, I don't know why this information has to be hidden from the world. I don't know why the government just wants us to be hurting within ourselves so much, man. Think about all the shit you learn in school, bro. I didn't learn anything in school how to make myself happy. The entire time I was in school, I wanted to die. Literally hated myself, hated it. All the terrible interactions I had, the, the bullying, the fighting, the girls breaking my heart, man, cheating on me, lying to me. Like, why does any of that stuff have to be within ourselves anymore, man? It's 2021. Think about a million years from now. I was talking about a million years from now, people are going to see what I was doing. Think about, think about the slaves. Like the slaves we had in the U.S., 
at one point everybody was like, oh yeah, slaves, it's just a normal thing, and then, then something happened, the fucking, the whole world changed, and they just realized that that shit was wrong. It's time to move past all the racism and bullshit, just like we moved away from slavery, man. Stop the greed, stop the pollution, stop worrying about, oh, I want to win the lottery and stuff. Like, money is part of the problem, dude. We're all fighting each other over money and all these imaginary things that were made inside of our heads. I'm going to say something that I've said to people before, and it's one of my favorite quotes, okay? The reason that we're all struggling inside and dealing with all this bullshit in the world, the reason is because we're living life in the environment that all the people who were born before us, all of those people who were born before us made all of our decisions. We had no say in it. So we were born into a world where people all hated each other, they're full of greed, and they're not loyal, and they're racist, and we had, we had no say in that, just because people were born before us, and they made all these terrible decisions, they're all hurting inside, but it's our responsibility, the people who were born after them, to change the world for the better, so when we die, and we are born again, we are born into a world where we have access to this information at an earlier stage in our lives, I wish I was five years old when I knew about time travel. I wish I was five years old when I knew how to fucking take all the sadness out of my brain. You understand that? Can you feel me? <laughs> like, I just, I just wanted to clear the air about some things. Like, it's, it, I was kind of like all over the place in this video and I was doing the stop and pause shit so I can just think. Like, I, I have so many things I can say just about, like, this type of stuff, and I just want you guys to know that I'm taking this serious. I have a really big plan, and I have a lot more to say. And I'm not trying to make anybody feel bad. When I say step it up, I mean we can, we should all step it up. We all have to step it up. And whether you believe me or not, the phrase step it up, like, that came from me. Like, something in my head says that step it up is just powerful as hell. Like, that, that can make someone angry, inspired, happy. It, it can mean a lot of things, but step it up is powerful. Like, step it up, bro, you know? <laughs> like, I say it all the time. Like, I'll be joking with my friends. I'll be like, step it up. When we're playing Xbox and shit, and they always get, like, all rustled up. They either get, like, hyped up or angry, you know? But, like, we all just, we just mess around with each other. That's how it is. And, and step it up, it, it means something to people, man. I don't know. Just thank, thank you for listening. This is a long-ass video. I'm just going to stop it here. Thank you. I love all of you. Hope you have a wonderful day. I don't care what you do with this information. Just tell it to anybody, man. If you figure out things on your own, tell some people. Write some notes. Write a journal. Write a book. Do anything. You don't even have to make videos like this. I'm just doing everything I possibly can to, to save the world, man. So when I'm born again, I'm not born into some bullshit that all the people in the past made for me. I'm born into the new generation that was healed by people like me and you. So yeah, thank you.